Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. Guys, does the color of your string really affect the play of your string? Well, I'm going to answer that today. Stay tuned. All right, guys, so what am I talking about here? Do string color of the same string affect the play of the string? Well, I'm going to start by talking about the most notorious of all, the Babolat RPM, okay, versus the Pro Hurricane Tour. For those of you who don't know, Pro Hurricane Tour came out first. Eight-sided string, yellow, okay? Has the same properties of, guess what, guys? RPM. Now, why did they develop RPM? Well, why did they develop Rafa? Okay? So that it would be a perfect match and you would buy a ton of them. That's the only thing they did. They basically took Pro Hurricane Tour, made it black, and said, it's RPM, rotations per minute. And guess who has the most rotations per minute on tour? Well, it's meant for Rafa. So we pair RPM swing, lefty, but I'm a right, real righty, with a black, cool-looking, named RPM. Okay? Now, but if you ask anybody who has played with both of these before, especially this one, and then going to this one, they're going to play, that's not the same string. And I'm like, if you look at the intellectual properties of the string, they're the same string. It even says it on the Babolat site. They're made out of the same thing. There's eight sides. It's a polyester, whatever, whatever. Okay. Side by side, right? Nothing different. Zero, zero. What's different? The color. Obviously, if you make something darker, there's more dye in it. What does more dye do? Probably makes it stiffer, right? Because obviously white has the least dye, black the most. Now, so this is the most notorious one. Now, in the latest color scandal we got polytor rev from yonex and even my man blade bynum said it played best in orange i'm like okay cool i like orange okay but now in their latest color scheme they added kind of a lavender purple and a white now, who knows why they chose all these weird colors? It's probably because it plays well. Okay? So now, I have I have my buddy Patrick, who's a huge fan of these strings. And he's decided to test the three colors and see if there's a difference. Okay? So, my man Patrick's in the house. And we got his three RFs here. Uh, we hybrided these, though. So... It's the same crosses, but the different mains. We got the Rev Orange. We got the Rev Lavender. We got the Rev White. They were all strung about the same time, same tension. Now, we're going to actually go with the field test first. Um, Patrick, first of all, thank you for joining me today and sure. bringing your sticks in. Uh, so... We've been using this orange, you've been using this orange for maybe six months now, maybe a little longer. Right. I really liked it when you strung me up with it, for sure. Perfect. Now, when you first played with it, what were the properties that you liked about it? Uh, what I like about these strings, for me, especially in my hands, it's, uh, I guess the best word for that I could always use is plushness. Okay. Like there's a, there's a little bit of softness in the hit, but then I know when it's a solid hit or not, but it doesn't feel like, like stiff. Right. Right. So it definitely has a, 
Uh, yeah, I Soft. guess. Plushes. Yeah, yes. Like a, like a little bit of a pillow. Okay. I like that feel. Okay. I kind of get what you're talking about because right. I felt the same. Now, we just got these in uh, about a month or two ago. And he said, let's try the other colors because, you know, wanted to change it up on, and see uh, if if it'll, well, you know, kind of look different more than anything else. But what Patrick noticed was, did they feel different? Let's go with the purple right. first. <laughs> I was really excited for the purple. I kept asking you every week, when's the purple come in? And I was hitting this and it, and it feels great, but it, something about it, it just felt not as pillowy. Mm. And for me in my head, it felt pitchy. Pitchy. If, if you will. Okay. So it, it, it just felt. Is it, it firmer? It, it felt Better? firmer to something. Okay. There's a, there's a, a ping to it, like okay. a like a higher pitch to it, and 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 I couldn't get past that feeling. It, it, it so felt, was it as plush? It, yeah, it felt sharp in my hands compared to the orange. Interesting. Sure. And then what about the white? Now the white, actually, you know, I was really excited because this was the, the the last one I tried, and it was way closer to the orange than the purple is, and I, I'm really liking the white. Okay. So I, you might convince me to go from orange to white just because it looks a little sleeker, but then the orange does stand out, which is nice. But the white was very close to the orange, in my opinion. So the white and the orange um, they were, felt yeah, they the were, same or they, similar. They felt, yeah, they felt close together. That The purple is the one that definitely was an outlier for me in my hands. Really? So my man, Patrick, is also a bass player, uh, kind of a cover band of the monkeys, if you're of that certain age. Hey, hey, with the monkeys. I know, I'm old. It doesn't matter. Um, anyways, so he actually has a tool that can can calculate pitch. Is that what it well, is? You know, I'm not a yeah. musician, so. <laughs> well, so I use the term musician very shyly, but in my nerding out of technology, I was I swear this was stiffer and higher pitched and just felt stiffer in my hands. So I grabbed a couple of guitar tuners and I put them on the frames just to see what happened. Okay. Can you show us? Like, how does it work? In, in my pursuit, I went and I take these little handheld guitar tuners and I, I just stuck them onto the frame as such. Oh, interesting. Let's uh, pitch it out. Against each other. So you can see it picks up the chord. Which right now it's a D. If I do purple, picking up a D sharp. So D, D sharp. So this is definitely tuned, if you will, higher in pitch than this. And that's what I was feeling in my hand. So does that mean it's stiffer when it's that way? The strings are technically tighter, in my opinion. Okay. Right. I feel that it's a pitch <laughs> higher, and it actually is about a half step, if you will, up so, an octave. So when, so you're talking in musician terms. Uh, let's translate that into tennis terms. When people ping the strings, if it's a pitch higher, that usually means it's tighter. Right. Okay. And that's again the feedback I'm getting. That pillow, that pillowness, pillowness. <laughs> I'm feeling here, not as pillowy over there. Got it. Got it. So we can maybe define that as being stiffer then, yes. right? Okay. So out of the three, I guess purple is slightly stiffer, um, but I guess slightly stiffer can be felt. Uh, so we've proved to you guys that color does matter in terms of strings. So be wary if you're that sensitive about your strings. If you have to have that neon yellow, it might play different than that, you know, off white. All right, guys. So I want to thank my man, Patrick, for hanging out with me today and bringing these uh, pitch sensors. Um, what are uh, these just, they're these? just straight guitar tuners. Oh, guitar tuners. Right. Okay. All right. I am not a musician, like I said. <laughs> All right. Thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis.